Lionel Messi ended his international career with Argentina by lifting the World Cup trophy in Qatar on Sunday, and the focus will soon shift to his club future at PSG. PSG president Nasser al khalafi revealed the club's contract with Lionel Messi to discuss the club's future. Messi joined the French Giants on a two-year deal in the summer of 2021, after Barcelona failed to re-sign the player due to their financial situation. After a rough debut season in Paris, he said he has successfully adapted to life in France this season, scoring 12 goals and providing 14 assists. He played a key role in Argentina's surprise World Cup victory over France on Sunday. Messi broke several records in the final, and eventually lost the golden boot to PSG's Kylian Bab, but his stunning hat-trick saw Argentina meet twice again. Messi, 35, went on to win the trophy. He scored two goals himself. With seven goals in this competition, Messi will be champion in the coming days and weeks. His contract in Paris expires in six months, however, and discussions about his future at club level will soon take place. Messi refused to answer the phone on behalf of the Barcelona president's close negotiator, Joan Laporta who wants the Argentine star to return to Camp Nou. Laporta's negotiating tactic has so far failed. Laporta planned to meet the former star at the Ballon d'Or ceremony in Paris in October, but that didn't work out. MLS side Inter Miami are another club tracking the Argentine, but despite reports that a deal has been agreed at the end of the season, Messi's future still hangs in the balance. PSG president Al Khalafi was upbeat when discussing the Argentines' future at the club after Sunday's final. He said, Should I leave Messi and Bap? Absolute. They are two of the best players in the World Cup. I don't want to say more about Leo. We have time to talk after the World Cup. Commenting on the impact the Parisian club stars have had on the entire World Cup, he added. Most importantly, PSG broke all records as a club. We are proud that they and Ashraf Hakimi finish fourth in Morocco. Al Khalafi, a member of the Qatari government, said of the match, that, dot, I think it was the best final in the history of the World Cup. As president of the French club, I mourn France. Shame on Killian who had a very good game. If it were me, I'd give two awards, one for Killian and one for Leo. It was hard because I was with France, but I'm also happy for Messi. It's good for him. He deserves it, and it will take years for Killian to win the World Cup.